Hi, I'm Alexa, and welcome to The Leftovers. This past Saturday was the third annual Winter's Works exhibit. The Winter's Works is a craft and art show created by Eli Liebman for young and emerging makers to show off and sell their work. Eli Liebman donated a portion of his makings from the Winter's Work exhibit to the nonprofit organization Books Through Bars. We sat down with Eli to discuss the Winter's Works exhibit and his interest in Books Through Bars. My experience with the Books Through Bars program has been fantastic. It's based in um, Turner's. It's called Great Falls Books Through Bars. And it's pretty nascent. It's only been running for maybe a year and a half, like operationally. And it's a wonderful group of people. Uh, once a month, we pack books and send out hundreds of books every month to people all over the country. People want to get involved, they can show up locally to volunteer day, they can donate money, they can read up and talk to their friends about, you know, improving literacy in America and thinking about incarceration, which is a big fact of American contemporary or and historical society. The impact of books through bars, I think, is like completely profound. Um, for people on the outside, it's like the smallest little window into what life is on the inside. And um, I think we go through our lives recognizing or without recognizing how much we have. And when you receive a letter from someone who's waited a month to receive three more books, I think it's like a profoundly transforming experience just to like be confronted with that. When people are incarcerated, they don't have any expectation that anybody will be thinking of them, maybe beyond their immediate family. And, you know, an act of kindness from someone that you don't know is, can be very profound. Eli Liebman is one of the many local artists who use their art to bring awareness and donate to organizations they're passionate about, whether that's through raising money or through showing a message through their art. This was The Leftovers. Thanks for watching.